The bitch made hundred and sixty thousand dollars in three days on the OnlyFans with the video of her and me. In three fucking days, one hundred and sixty thousand dollars. That's why the bitch sucked his dick in a bathroom stall. I'm just saying. For one hundred and sixty thousand in three days. Don't yeah. answer me yet. We gonna talk on the show. You made me. I was gonna <laughs> say you made me forget my moment with Mo with that shit. I I'm just made, saying. Kudos, man. I'm just she saying. Won. I was ready to say. That's we ain't start the show yet, yo, chill. That's why these bitch ass niggas be getting on my nerves. Man. No, for real. Because these niggas be in privileged situations and be out here carrying themselves and conducting themselves like fucking class. The crazy part is shorty like, yo, ain't even like that. If for you real. fucking Lil Meech, no, if I'm Lil Meech, none of you raggedy nothing ass bitches is sucking my dick in the bathroom. Do you want to know why? You want to know why? You know who can suck my dick in the bathroom if I'm Lil Meech? Rihanna. Rihanna, Beyonce, hot. Because at that point, it made something. That made my arms strong. Hell For yeah. me to get the little nothing ass bitch who care about making 160000 for posting the video of oh, sucking my dick. Save it, save it, save it. Like, I don't even want to suck my dick. Like, yo, I, 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 give me the top notch bitch who, like, we should not be fucked up. <laughs> Yo. Yo, the levels, the levels, the levels, the levels is good. The levels is good. The levels is good. good. You are now tuned in to the Levels Podcast. I'm one half of your host. I go by the name of Envy. That's E N V I E, and I am not a DJ. No matter what this big head girl right here next to me say, you uh, know what I'm saying you know what's going on, Dabby. I'm the <laughs> other half of your host, Dabby Bo. You heard me. The only Dabbies is the females who had babies out of wedlock. After they watched their mother struggle to raise their dirty asses anyway. He said what he said. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> and y'all already know what That's it is, bad. man. We are back. You know what I'm saying? My little sister's in the building and again. Y'all introduce yourself, please. It's the Baltimore Ballad. It don't get no better. The one and only. It ain't no other Baltimore Ballads. You our bitches is either my kids or imposters. Already, All right. she said what she said, you know what I'm saying? Yo, like, we, we, we've we been already talking behind the scenes, you know what I'm saying, about the show. But before we get into the topic, though, first of all, yo, how, how was your week? Yo, we took a couple weeks off, so what's going on with you, though? Nah, yo, it's been stressful. You can just say it's hard out here. I'm trying to keep bitches in order. You can just mm-hmm. say you know how hard it is to do to do that. You get what I'm saying? They <laughs> always step out. They don't even know how to walk. And these bitches don't even take a scale with them to buy weed. And we expect them to conduct themselves like they got sense. Already, listen, man. Listen, my bad. Y'all, he got me. I was laughing. Man. That's a hell of a week right there. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Taking, taking his time off community service. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? In, in the city of Baltimore, in our city. I'm trying to improve the outlook. Already. BB, what you been up to? I was saying she was here last year. It's been a little minute for real. Just been out here doing more important shit. You know, already, already cooking and I went to the store. M- music got the store, and good eats, fucking with the studio. Yeah. And already. then it's tourist season. A lot of bullshit. Facts. Big on. bullshit. A lot of bullshit <laughs> going on. A lot of partying man. and bullshit. Mm. But no bullshit. Y'all know what's going mm. on. Just taking it easy, man. My week been cool. I've been chilling. Hell yeah. We glad you back, though, for real. You know what I'm saying? Thanks for having me. Glad to have you back, for real. You know, my sister's back in the building. Y'all already know. Everybody that's been familiar with the show, y'all already familiar with Bella. So, you know what I'm saying? She going to jump right into this one. We was talking behind the scenes, man, about this whole uh, Selena Powell and Lil Meech and, and, and the Summer Walker shit. And the real shit is, like, I got... I got I'm going I'm to kick it to y'all on this, but before I do, I'm going to give y'all the whole entire situation. So, Summer Walker, first of all, shout out to you, Summer Walker, because oh, you're a motherfucking sad bitch. I fuck with you. Summer Walker, like three months ago, posted a picture of her and some other nigga. Yo got her, her name tattooed on his face. She got his name tattooed on her face. Damn. They booed up for real. We thinking like, oh, this is her nigga for real. <laughs> Next thing we know, Shorty popped up with the BMF chain on like, Damn. fuck y'all. Whoop de whoop. So she with the she, she with y'all. She still got the tattoo. I don't. I couldn't see. She had a hat on and then uh, she had a hair. Y'all she had a hair. So I don't know. In jail going through whatever y'all going through. The world is spinning. That's a big fact. Why you had to say in jail though? Anything. The world shit. is spinning. You don't know where that nigga had. You ain't around. <laughs> shit. Shit goes down. <laughs> Just saying. Right. Shit. Only difference is they they on Instagram with it and shit. Like they go hard. That's what I mean. That's rich people problems. Yo, when you yeah. rich, you can do that type shit. Whatever. Yeah. Like you know what I'm saying. But um. Now that we know Summer Walker and, and, and Meech is together, she popped up with the BMF chain on. And a young lady named Selena Powell 
jump out. For all the people that's like my age, I know this shit because I'm a journalist. Fuck y'all. Judge your mother. I am a journalist, <laughs> and I be doing my research. Hold on. What type of journalist is you? Me? DJ yeah. Journalist. I'm a street journalist. So I be hearing shit at my dom and this shit. And oh. I be hearing shit when I be around Papa <laughs> Boy yeah, and shit. No, yeah. I call BB. I be like, yo, yeah. fuck is going on? Oh, what that <laughs> okay. Yeah, no. Already. <laughs> That's how I know what's up with what I did for real. Bella younger than me, so she keep me up with what's going on and shit. Okay. But, uh, but for those that don't know, Selena Powell was like, um, was light skinned shorty from back in the day, fucked all the niggas and did the book and exposed all the rest. Super Stapp- 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 one. Yeah. She like she like the new age superhead, right? <coughs> if Superhead had Instagram, <coughs> she would have been Selena Powell. Jay Z and okay. all of the niggas would have been all fucked up. Everybody okay. would have been fucked up. All right. But um, so Selena Powell's like that. Okay. She be fucking celebrities. Yeah, she the and new superhead. Like yeah. daughter. I don't know if she nobody daughter. I don't know. She is Colin somebody's Powell. daughter. But but she not Colin Powell. <laughs> She better not be calling her back. Allegedly. Oh, allegedly. Allegedly. Oh, on this show, she is. Yeah. Allegedly. Yeah, yeah. Allegedly. Oh, I know. Yeah. <laughs> she Clifton Powell cool. daughter. Yeah, Clifton <laughs> Powell. That's, that's, that's yeah, his daughter. somebody. All y'all daughters. Yeah. Nah, real shit. No, damn, that was fucked up. <laughs> not all y'all daughters. Shit, y'all yeah. got daughters, y'all. My bad, y'all. They can be like, fuck your daughter too, nigga. Yo, my bad, yo. But no, but look. So she be, that's what she be doing. She be fucking hella celebrities and shit like that. Yeah. And she done made it into a business. You know what I'm saying? Shout out DJ it's Academics. So he started her off for real. DJ Academics kind of built Shorty. You know what I'm saying? Well, he she, fucked her. Yeah, I I, yeah. Never and seen. then and then she she had fucked Chief Keith, and then she tried to expose Chief Keith or whatever. And then she blew from there. Yo just kept posting her, talking about her, and built her up to now where she made that shit into a business for real. She be got her own show. She her only fans is going stupid. Like she get hella money, and she you know what you I'm saying? she do what she do. Me. Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm working on y'all know I told y'all last time I'm in the gym I'm working on my six pack gray sweatpants is coming in real soon gray pants. I, you know I do got only pants. Oh, am I on her only? I ain't that popular yet. I'm not that popular. I got only pants. Oh, but you making the only pants? Yeah. I'm gonna get only. Yeah, bro. Y'all check for me on only pants. Y'all not getting no fuck. No. The Levels Podcast is going to be on OnlyFans. Yo, y'all can get on there and just show y'all fans. feet. Y'all be surprised. No, Ask skinny shit. ain't no. <laughs> not with your feet. No, that's feet, crazy. Nigga feet. So. My feet nice. I don't know about nobody else's feet. I, I take care yeah, of mine. Yeah, I be saying you be having your feet out because you go to the island. That's so a fact. Like. <laughs> if you wear socks on the island, nigga. Feet look like. If you wear socks on the island, you ain't never been nowhere yeah, before, nigga. If you want to see my Step feet. your shit up. Holy fast at skinny eight bitty. <laughs> what the fuck they talking about? This nigga stupid shit. Skinny eight bitty. If you went, if you yeah, went, yeah. if you went <laughs> socks with your slides on the beach, you in either, the water, in the water, if you either get money and you from Baltimore, mm. or you ain't never been nowhere before and you don't know no better, y'all. Take, your, them feet take your Jordans off. The fuck up. <laughs> take your Jordans off on the beach, nigga. Like stop it, yo. You look stupid. Like they don't like that. Like the. That bitches don't like that at all. Like, stop it. That is bad. You look crazy. Bad. Nigga, if you're on the beach with... Like or, or if you're from New York, you got Tim's on and you want to... Like, stop it, my nigga. You in Miami with butters, like, you got to relax. You got to relax. Where you nigga. from originally? Me? Yeah. I'm from Baltimore originally. Oh, all right. I stayed in the Bronx, though. Why you ask me that? No, I just... And oh, I, I no. thought you was originally from New York. Me too. Mm. I did think that. Mm. Yeah. I lived it. I lived in the Bronx. No, we might not check into that. Yeah, you know. cause he lived <laughs> in New York. No, this real shit. Or Philly. I lived. In, I lived in. So, so. Bro, you just sound like you from so the my, Bronx. My outside times, I I moved to New York for a little while with my people and and got in trouble and then. Which one you came like better? Here. Oh, Baltimore is my shit. Like, nah, New York, I, I can't do it. Like, I, I'm not one of them, so it's different. Like, yeah, you up there. Yeah. Now, when I'm up there, they know I'm from Baltimore because I say shit like Doug. Yeah. You know, they say yeah. they say coffee, and I say yeah. coffee, and I, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I'll be like, I'm finna go to the store. Like, I sound like a country nigga today. Right. But you up here, I say the certain deli. shit. Like, sneakers. Go to the deli. I say words like sneakers. Yeah, we looking at you and like. And y'all say tennis shoes. Yeah. And then I sound and like I'm from somewhere else. you put them yatas on, boy, mm-hmm. you just look like you. Mm-hmm. Oh, I know how I wear my Tims, though. That's a fact. Rough rider. No, I know, how I, wear, I know how I wear my butters, for real. That's no, you wear your butters like mm-hmm. a New York nigga. I know how to wear my butters. <coughs> That's the only DMX way to wear it. DMX from New York or Philly? You said New York. DMX? DMX from New York. Yeah, New York. He from Yonkers. Yeah, he from New York. But, um, but yeah, so, so Shorty B, uh, Selena Powell, she be fucking all the celebrities and shit. Summer Walker post the chain, Selena Powell come right back at, you know what I'm saying? Right after that, the same day, stupid. with another BMF chain on, Certified and then home. and then drop the video of her sucking Meech 
of in the in the bathroom stall while somebody recording this shit. This is the type shit she do, though. No, I ain't slut shaming. This is the type shit she do. I like her. No, I, I, listen, right. I, I asked you not to bring her back. Right. Yeah, but so far. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no. Nah, she on it. Yeah, she doing good. That'd be that. You, the way you working right now, you can come back and get it. Right, but don't get it fucked up. We don't be, we don't just be talking about hoes and making them famous and none of that shit on this show. Cause what she did is regular shit. She sucked a nigga dick, mm-hmm. a celebrity dick in the bathroom. Like mm-hmm. bitches been doing that for forever. Yeah. Nigga, the Hard Knock Life tour is out. Like that shit was from the nineties. Yeah, shit, but, but like, like, what be making? <coughs> mm-hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. What go through bitches' head where they sit there before they do some lame ass shit? Right. Like exposing. Or hitting the bitch DM about a nigga. Or mm. asking the nigga about a bitch. What go through a bitch head the moment before you ask? You don't think like, Kid. that's some lame ass clown ass it's, shit I'm redo or is. say. Yeah, right, right. No, Kid. they don't think that because clowns don't think that. Because I feel sad. Like, I, I think about shit before I said, especially when it's a nigga involved. Because as a female, you know, especially when it comes to bringing other females up. Mm-hmm. You don't know that that make niggas more curious about that That's bitch. That's a fact. That's a fact. Or but, like you hitting a bitch up or even trying to expose that you was fucking with a nigga. Mm-hmm. Do you understand how lame that make you look? It make you look like don't know niggas like bitches yeah. that kiss and tell. No, that's a fact. And we gonna go deep into that that same topic can too we, on the other side. Y'all do it. No, I was just gonna know. say no, that's can, a we, fact. can we segue into the moment with Mo. Oh no! Hey, 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 if had, you got if you got the moment with Mo, handle your business. Cause it's it's so onto what you get to say. Ballo, the point Ballo just made. I you get to say I wanted to say I wanted to tell y'all. You get to say from my perspective, like baby, if you fucking with a nigga boyfriend, you can't tell his girlfriend. Like who the fuck is you? You just as much at fault as he is. You, it don't make wow. you better. Because you the one who got guilty conscience. You get to say you participated in the fuckery all the same. And I would take it a step further and say, you should tell her that you the one who brought him the PS5. The one who brought him the Yeezys. You get what I'm saying? Well, what make it even more clowns out, not to even cut you up, is that it'll be some shit like... Her and the nigga get into it. Or some shit won't go the bitch way. Mm-hmm. And then now she ready to go tell everything. That's so clowned out. Can I tell out. you the kicker? At the end of all that, you still gonna be a side bitch, bitch. Because you strip bigs. And you, then you gonna do all that Facts. about a nigga that's you. still gonna fuck. You might even wanna fight the bitch. You wanna fight me. Over a nigga that still won't fuck with me after the fight. I mean, I'm just saying. Stupid. You crazy before, bitch. But, but, I'm going to throw a curveball, though. She did the shit because three days later, after she put it out there, the bitch made $160,000 on her OnlyFans posting that video. $160,000. Verified, not a rumor. Real shit. I I I'm a, I told you I'm a I'm a journalist. I researched <laughs> it. She made one hundred and to be to be all the way honest, yeah. one hundred and fifty seven thousand dollars on her OnlyFans page. After See, it'd be video lame out. for me to speak on that if I ain't, you found me got a hundred and sixty k. I'm just saying. The right way. I'm but just saying. But it's still lame. On it's still how lame. You did it. But the crazy part still is lame. that now with the new age. Sad Lame that's shit. How you can capitalize Motherfuckers shit. is getting money off of that it's shit. It's marketable. Think about it. And now Corinne Stephens wrote a book. Right. She wrote a book, got famous off that shit. She got bread off of it. Like, you know what I'm saying? But it is what it now. is. Huh? What's she at now? I mean, that shit ain't, it ain't longevity in it. But get your bag and, and figure out what you're going to do with it, though. You could do a lot with $160,000. That ain't longevity in it, but. Nah. I mean, but she been around for like 10 years, though. I'm not going to hold you. She like 27 right now. Like she been doing this shit, no, not 10 years. She been doing this shit since she was like 21. I mean, it's completely Selena acceptable. If that's, yeah. It's completely acceptable yeah. if she has no intentions on having any type of marital future 
children, shit mm-hmm. like that. Like, and if she or if she plans on doing that, because who am I to say that she don't deserve that? But if she does plan on that, just accepting the fact that these things might backfire. Yeah, it's in gonna the come up. It's gonna come up later. I mean, I look at it like this, yo. We talked about this on the show the other day. Does that mean I mean, it's gonna be fans. some lame ass nigga. No, I'm just not famous. No, but it's gonna be some lame ass nigga with 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 some money. That's gone. That's gone. You know what I'm saying? Pick shorty up and and and, and wife her, take care of her, whatever the case might be. I don't know. Uh, or she might only fuck with the celebrity niggas to expose them and put it on the OnlyFans and make her money off of it. Maybe she got some bum ass nigga that just play PlayStation well, and she taking care of him. I would say the I place more I onus know. on the nigga mm-hmm. than I do baby girl. You get what I'm saying? This Back. shit has been prevalent since we was kids. You remember? Like, like niggas know better. Like come on. we used to bank bitches in the in the in the bathrooms up Walbrook. You understand what I'm saying? It's didn't the same. have this wasn't filming it. We ain't have Instagram and shit. But like they the that. same hey, females. That's the point I'm making. You get mm-hmm. what I'm saying? We never. So you gotta be accountable to yourself. That's the point I'm making. You get yeah. what I'm saying? If it's a female who you know right. is of a certain nature, caliber, right. yeah, which is yeah, less than. Yeah. I mean, you got to know when you when, you, th- when you meet somebody like Shorty and you, and she say, hi, how you doing? My name is so boom, boom. You know who she is. Yeah. You know what it is. And you get into the situation. It's like, yo, now I'm going to say this though too. I feel like he took it on the chin though. Yeah. They I'm going to say because it. because it don't mean shit. Right. It don't mean shit. At, at, at the end of the day. Still post that. Was... Yeah. At the end of the day, on camera or off camera, we all got head before we was in our current right. situations. You know right. what I'm saying? Right. The only difference is, is that the bitch named Tanya not popping up out of nowhere right. on Instagram saying I suck with the video. Right. You know what I'm saying? And if she did, well, I'd be mean, like, well shit. I got my I got my dick up. Put your chain on. Yeah, that like all that. Like, I mean, but that's what that's what I mean that's that's regular. You know what I'm saying? I was letting bitches wear my chains back then too. Like, nah, if I'm not in a relationship, nah. like I don't give a fuck. Like if she be like, oh, put your chain on, like, I don't give a fuck. Like you just yeah. suck my dick in the bathroom. The least yeah. I could do is let you wear my chain. <laughs> yeah, like, but see that shit corny too though. Because the bitch who, who sucks your dick in the bathroom, she should not be a no, representation she, she of your chain. She shouldn't be in the room yeah, like that. That's what's right. We gotta take this shit out the window on that. You know what I'm saying? You don't deserve to wear the chain. Fuck it with her. No, yeah, I mean he, he could have he could have been really with fucking with her. Cause look, at the end of the day, and this ain't true. I ain't talking to Lil Meech. I'm talking about niggas with money. Yeah. Just cause you get money don't mean you what you not a clown or you wasn't a clown before that. And a lot of these niggas never Can't. fuck with no bitches before. Yeah. Like they had like little hood bitches or whatever. They never seen no bad bitch off of and Shorty is not bad at all, by the way. But I'm saying they never seen this type of shit. Before they got money. Basketball players, football players, all of these niggas. Yeah. Just keeping it step. Yeah. The rapper niggas. Some of these niggas was dusty ass, dirty ass, bum ass yes. niggas back in the day. Yeah. The, the basketball niggas, all they do is play basketball. They don't got no social skills. They only get bitches because they play ball. And so, when the baddest bitch on your Instagram feed or the nastiest bitch on Instagram walk up to you and say, Yo, I will suck your dick in the bathroom on camera, you and whoever else... A lot of these, yo, the flesh is weak, my nigga. Like, you might, this might be your first time being a celebrity and being able to say, oh, shit, she gonna do whatever I wanted to do. You might do that shit, man. Like, shit. Shout out to Easy E. I love, I love Easy E. Like, a bitch walking up to your house, you be like, oh, baby, like, you baby. Yeah. Bake me. But that's down because I don't like it. I look at it down, like, yo. Okay, I'm I, fine, you I'm ain't. just, I'm just heavy for the levels podcast. Why the fuck you want to suck my dick in the bathroom? I'm gonna think something up with you. Like, what, what you mean? You try to set me up? But if you a celebrity and it's eighty bitches just saying I'm gonna suck your dick in the bathroom, I mean, shit. How many of you eighty bitches <laughs> got wet rigs on? Nine, okay, nine of them. yeah, seven of them. Well, okay, the other seventy three can leave. Mm-hmm. Let me talk to the seven who who burned. You get what I'm saying? I. I like a certain caliber of female. You I, like that's why your, I keep. You like married bitches? I don't like married bitches, but I'm saying if it's What's a bitch who gonna suck my dick in the bathroom, I don't want the the seventy three single bitches who go go leave out of here and suck the next nigga dick in the bathroom too. At least let me dwindle this shit down to a certain <laughs> caliber I of get female. That. You I get, get what I'm saying? The female who willing to commit yeah, herself to another nigga by so wearing a wedding ring, I like y'all. Nah, I. You get what I'm saying? She, cause she not gonna record Listen, me. Man. She That's got a nigga to go home to. I no. don't want to play these dumbass. Well, games. well, well. In this situation, the bad part is, is that she didn't record it. They recorded it. Who? Whoever was with them in the bathroom. She ain't had a phone in her hand. The phone was on. Somebody else was holding the phone. 
or the camera or whatever it was they recorded with. Somebody else was holding that shit. Shit that worse. wasn't them. Like so I'm just all I'm saying is, is that, that they made a conscious decision. They had supervision. That's that freaky. They had the conscious. They did. A, they made a conscious decision. Yeah. Porn shit. shit. No, yeah. real shit. I'm just saying. Oh, they be on some shit. Yeah, that was shit. too much. I'm just saying. So, what they was in the the wheelchair. That's what I'm saying. No, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. The family, the family, family yeah. dog. Okay, so I. They was in the family that's, store that's where you change your diapers at shit. Okay, so you can see from the video that he ain't recording neither. Yeah. So okay. it's clearly a third person. Clearly, clearly a third or, or however many people was in there in the bathroom was more okay. than just them two. Yeah, facts. Okay. Facts. That's a fact. But I mean, look, half of y'all aunties and y'all mothers was at Freaknik in Atlanta and was sucking dick in bathrooms and just wasn't recording. It's so, it's so crazy. I'm just he saying. He probably texted her. Yeah, no, that was cool. that sounds scripted. They you probably is cool, like we don't know, but I'm, I mean, I'm sure he ain't wanted to come out right at that moment or whatever. But at the same time, I'm like, yo, he ain't do shit wrong. Like, if you, I'm single, my nigga. Like, sorry, shorty. I, yes, I fucked bitches before I met yeah. you. Like, what you want me to say? You know what I'm saying? I fucked bitches before I met you. Yeah. Some of it might have been on camera. That's the same thing, like saying a, a girl that used to do porn don't deserve to be in a relationship she after don't. that. Like, she don't. Nah, you fucked up, yeah. Yes, she did, y'all. Yes, she. That was her job, What's the yo. Time? I don't know. I don't know. Why do a female? But she be wilding too, though. So it's not like he the only one. You know what I'm saying? Some of my got videos out there. We don't know. Some of Walker be listen. She no, a savage. On, Cause I don't like how you try to skip by that shit. It's like you you try to hopscotch by. You get what I'm saying? What like a female who did poor deserves. No, yeah, she do. That's her job. So do a nigga that did porn, do he deserve to find a bitch and settle down and be with her? Nope. You wildin', shorty. Like, nah, I, nope. I gotta disagree with you on that, yo. Nope. My job nope. was to fuck bitches on camera. I got paid to do that shit before That's, I met that you. That wasn't your fucking job. Now that when was your I met passion. You, that was my job. I mean, I'm saying, I, I turned my passion into, ain't that what entrepreneurs do? <laughs> <laughs> ain't that what entrepreneurs do? <laughs> it turns something I love into a job. Me. You said what? Your bro, I don't deserve nobody. I'm saying they both deserve somebody, but it's an unfair, ex it's unrealistic for either one of a man or woman to be a ex porn star and be like, yo, now I'm ready to settle down. I'm not saying that you yeah, as a person like, don't what? deserve that, why? but it's like, I'm shorty, ex, I'm an ex porn star. I, I have a catalog of reasons why. I don't be doing that anymore. No now I want to be in a relationship with you. What's wrong with that? You can look her up. You, you know, know I fuck niggas on, you know I, pause. You Whoa! Know, I'm, come on, yeah. No, I'm not gonna let you do that. I'm not I said pause, that. yo. Even you hey, yo, edit that you shit gotta out. relax. No, I don't edit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I said, yo, we come on, talk bro. About that shit. <laughs> <laughs> we gonna go into that though. We gonna go into that. Not with me, but we gonna go into that. Pause with that too. Going into pause. that. Pause. Too. Yeah, but, but no, what I'm saying is, if you know that she fucked niggas on camera, you knew that when you met her. You met. Fucking, uh, 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 fucking Jada Fire or whoever the fuck it was. You met her knowing who the fuck she was. Yeah. Now she don't do that no more, and me and her kicking it, and I end up liking her like that. I mean, shit, like, what the fuck I'm supposed to do? Kill yourself. I mean, yeah, shit, it, you gotta like, be a certain caliber no, nigga or a certain no. caliber bitch to be able to handle yeah, it. Yeah, cause, like, no. <laughs> yeah, that's what's saying. No, but come what on, you, you really fuck with the nigga. <laughs> Baby, you really fuck with that nigga. <laughs> you met him. At the club or some shit, y'all kicked it. You we fuck with them. We just want lock in. We ain't going. Yeah. I ain't cuffing. Yeah. Why though? Yeah. All right, tell me why. Go ahead. Tell me why. Cause I feel like you gotta be a certain caliber nigga to have a certain type of confidence that you can that deal with that no, shit. No, that's insecurity. Yeah, the insecurity <laughs> is gonna stop is. you. No, the insecurity is going to allow you to make a fool of yourself and commit yourself to a bitch who is on camera letting niggas bust on our face, swallow another niggas nut, letting niggas. Blow our asshole open. I don't understand what we but talking about. But you realize about. that every bitch you meet has let a nigga nut in her Not face and, and bust her asshole yeah, open, Yeah, right? but other niggas can't pull it up and show it to me. You said other what? Niggas Maybe. I said every bitch you meet or every nigga you met is, has the same shit that's happened. He you, probably ate some ass. He, he, he ate hella pussy, I'm okay. sure. And oh, he probably did some wild shit. And he probably yeah. fucked some fat bitches. Yeah. Yeah. You get you, you buy Jada I mean, Fire. Yeah, you might not be able to Google it, but you I'm just saying. You Jada Fire. You buy... Oh my goodness! I'm gonna give you the what's 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 baby day with the with the ass, which one? Cherokee. Cherokee. You buy Cherokee. You understand what I'm saying? You know these Every you time you, me, you hold on. Go ahead. Go ahead. Every time you come around me, right? I'm gonna have a different video plan. 
And I'm going to be mad if you get mad. Like, yo, why, this shit is up here for the world to see. Why is you mad at me for looking at it? No, you getting yeah, in my no, car, I, I, it's playing through the speakers. No, you wild. She's calling yeah. another no, nigga daddy. No, because you trying to, now you trying to, no. I'm cause giving you the reality. You trying to it. give us a, no, nah, yo. Here's the thing. Here's the reality. Here's the reality. A porn star bitch, and let's let's just say that some of these porn star bitches are some of the baddest bitches in the world, right? Yep. They got the ass, they got the face, they got everything. And you know they freaks. They get busy for real. You trying to tell me that if you met her shorty in the club somewhere and she was feeling you like that, and she like, yo, like, you know what I'm saying, what's up? That you would be on some like, no, nah, yo, I ain't fucking with her because she used to do her. this. I'm fucking her. What if you start liking her? I'm not going to start. I got mind control over Debo. I'm going <laughs> to start liking her. <laughs> <laughs> All I'm saying is, I got I got a homeboy, not saying nobody name because I don't put him out. That's my man's for real. I fuck with him. And he his wife used to, you know what I'm saying, be in the adult industry. You know what I'm saying? And he he's okay with it. You know what I'm saying? It's not like niggas be running around bringing it up with nothing. See, that, that's the caliber nigga. Like, you got to have respect for me to not throw that shit in my face all the time. Because now, if I'm around niggas that always be like, yeah, yo, because, you know, I, your girl video, huh, like, nigga, calm the fuck down. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm going to start... Yeah, in the respect. Face. But I like I love Shorty, and I'm I can get over it. So why you can't get over it? I can get over it. I don't want you to think that I can't get over it. But I can't. Oh, let me pull the shots that we for you. Let oh yeah, do that, do that. Did you get the shot glasses out? All right, we're gonna do it. All right, I got something in my cup. So all right, well, that's it. That was but no, I'm so saying, I'm saying. I'm saying. All right, so BB, you for real? Like you really? You you said you putting your lip gloss on, you know what I'm saying? You make yourself look good, ooh, ooh, and then the nigga walk up to you, Mr. Marcus or some shit, walk up to you and be like, you know, hey, what's up, y'all? I kind of like you. You like him too. And then you find out somebody, you know what I'm saying, Tay, Tay come up to you and be like, yo, you know who that is? That's Mr. Marcus. You're going to be like, oh, fuck that nigga. Now you're not fucking with him no more? Mr. Marcus. He could be the nigga that give you multiple orgasms and take care of you and all that type shit. You gonna be like, nah, I ain't fucking with because he fuck girls on camera. Be honest. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It really depends. It really depends. I can't say. But no, I'm really not feeling it. Like he ain't fuck bitches you know on camera. You don't know them. You. Not, you talking about I don't like them. Like, <laughs> what? Yeah. Oh, I'm just like I don't know, cause I'm just not. I just don't be liking niggas. <laughs> I, I just don't be out here liking niggas, like before I know what's up with them. How you I'm saying, but that? that's not to me. That's not what's up with them, though. That ain't. That's that not. That is to, what's up with them. That was his past. He fucked hella bitches. When oh. you when you ask what's up, man, you you know you ask. You know right. what, you know what's, going what's up on. with her, bro? Yeah. I'm be like, yo, oh, I, yeah, I'm that sure. bitch used to be a yeah. porn star. That's the first right? yeah. thing. I'm gonna be like, jackpot. You he hit ain't, that one? nigga ain't gonna, yeah, bro, ain't gonna tell you. Oh, yeah, no, nah, shorty from down such and such. She, that's such and such people. Hey, well, she used to be a porn star. I'd rather her yeah, be a, I fucked her. I'd rather her be a porn star. No, see, Next that's different. Question. You just said, yeah, I fucked her. No. Nah. I'd rather her be a porn star really? than for my nigga to come up to me and be like, y'all, yo, she used to be around West Baltimore fucking all the niggas around West Baltimore. And she didn't even get paid for it. I'd rather have a bitch that at least made that shit into a business, man. Like, shit, fuck is we talking about? Like, she turned her passion into a fucking business, my nigga. I'm this just saying. nigga be blowing my yeah. fucking She's a genius. With the shit he said. <laughs> She's a genius. I don't even know if he, for <laughs> real, this shit be so... <laughs> She's a genius, my nigga. Like, she turned some shit that every bitch do into multi million dollar business, my nigga. Like she That's getting not money. Genius. Prostitution been around since the beginning of time. All right, but she put it on film, and now she, get, you know, what I'm saying they get money from it. What's genius? What's the about? difference? What's the difference between her and the bitch that fuck all it's the niggas? It's actually away? lazy. You, <laughs> if we be an artist, I was lazy. It's lazy. <laughs> this is a bunch of bitches who do it off camera for free, bitch. If you really. They the dumb ones. They no, the dummies. They not the dumb ones. They the dummies. No, they not the dumb ones. Get your money. I say, I this this is my theory, right? The niggas is the dumb ones. Let's just be clear. If you're a virtual stripper versus a physical stripper, that's just you being lazy. You get what I'm saying? I mean, saying? yeah, that yeah, the, yeah. The niggas who subscribe to OnlyFans, mm -hmm. 
they the dubbies. You get what I'm saying? Because it's okay. like dubby. You you can go to a strip club and actually and touch, touch the, the bitch. bitch. Yeah, yeah, you get what I'm saying? That's a fact. Like I, it don't make sense. It's lit though. No, it is. But I'm saying, but he, I get From what he's saying though. For me, sense. for me personally, I feel like yo, if I'm gonna go to your OnlyFans and and tip money and pay money to see you naked, I would prefer to just go down the, the strip club where you can sit on my lap. Yeah. And I can physically yeah. be around that's this person that I'm lusting after, right? I can yes. physically be around her. Now, to take it a step even further, though, from that, wouldn't you rather, instead of going to the strip club, why not give us some money and actually fuck the bitch that I like? You could do that at the strip club, too. Hey, yo, they see that, yo. You, see, you, gonna take, you know me and him disagree on this topic, y'all. And you too, make sure that y'all comment down below. Like and subscribe the video too, but make sure y'all comment down below and tell me which one you rap. To me personally, I feel like all the girls in the strip club are not selling pussy, bro. Nah, fuck no. That's not true, y'all. It's a certain. I strip. There's certain are you women selling pussy. Okay, I ain't say you is. I'm, I'm just not saying. saying that you is, but let me just say this. This is all I'm gonna say. This is why I hold niggas accountable. I don't get into what the females do so much as. I take all the niggas by the set. You get what I'm mm -hmm. mm -hmm. To your point. Yeah, I would rather fuck her. Right. Than to tip her to see her naked. Right. You get what I'm saying? Right. Yes. A thousand percent. I don't okay. want you to question that. You get what I'm you. saying? Mm -hmm. I'm only simply saying that I'm also not going to tip her to see her naked. What you mean? So he's like, oh, what that bitch? I'm like, shorty, what's up? You try to go upstairs? No. And then, then you I move on to the next yeah, one. Yeah, because I'm I, not here for that. So <laughs> if you here to get these hundred ones I'm ready to throw at you, and then I'm going to offer you $500 to fuck you, you get what I'm saying? I'm not saying that every female is going to take that bait, right. but I'm not wrong in my train of thought of assuming that I got a good shot. Like, I'm going to be like seven for ten, dummy. You, you, never, you, never wrong, saying? you never wrong for shooting your shot, but then... With your same logic, she ain't wrong for trying to get her money for the least amount that she got yeah. here as well. Yeah. <laughs> she ain't wrong. Yeah. So, so for me, I look at it like if you in the strip club shaking ass and niggas is touching on you and slapping your ass and all that shit. Or you could go to OnlyFans where niggas cannot put their hands on you. You don't know where their dirty ass hands been at. Yeah. And you can still make your money on OnlyFans. I say get your fucking money. And also, if you can make money from doing some shit you like, like sex. Nigga, you telling me that if... if, 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 if Evil Angel came to you and was like, yo, dummy mo, like, we want you to do this porn. We're going to pay you to fuck bitches on camera. You wouldn't do it? We not the same. <laughs> it's not the same. I'm going to tell you all something right now. <laughs> it's not the same. I do only for this. So I'm, I'm first mm -hmm. hand speaking that, I mean, I, I, I really can't choose because I'm going to do both. Right, okay. You know, I dance and I do only for this. Mm -hmm. But... OnlyFans is definitely a, a, a good steal. It's some people, it's some niggas that don't like the the the, the club, the club uh, thing. It's not right? even so much as touching. Uh, they just don't like true. the club thing. That's true. And you feel me? It's some niggas that shy. It's some niggas that got fetishes that they not proud of displaying. Oh, they don't want to put Whatever it out there, the right? case that's may true. be, but it's just so much money on there, so I can't even downsize it. So if you I had, if you had the opportunity, if you had the opportunity to, to make the same amount of money with only OnlyFans. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? If you had the same the opportunity to make the same amount of money with just OnlyFans and not have to go in the club and put them big ass heels on and, and, and swing around the pole and do all that shit. That shit is work. Let's be real. Would you just do OnlyFans? Would you stop going to the club and just do OnlyFans? Yeah. OnlyFans. OnlyFans is is a lot of work though. Like yeah, no, like, yeah, yeah. OnlyFans is a lot of work because you have to deal with a lot of freak balls. That's true. That's true. Like you gotta be mentally ready to deal with a lot of the shit that's gonna come your way when it comes to dealing with. Oh, you mean like niggas be requesting wild shit? Yeah, it like niggas gonna be requesting wild shit. Niggas gonna be requesting shit that you never even heard of. You feel me? I mean, yeah. Like yeah. it's gonna be some people. I I, I I'm I don't know. I All just I'm know saying that, is, I just know that. Go ahead. Yeah. If somebody, if somebody would pay me, if somebody would pay me, fucking, fucking fifty thousand dollars to shit on some plastic on camera on OnlyFans, 
You know what I'm saying? Then shit, I'm gonna get my 50 racks, my nigga, and I'm gonna take a shit on fucking camera. Like, I'm just saying, is that low? No, that's exaggeration. No, no, that's not. Don't ever. No, no. Some celebrities, be, yeah, they be getting to it. All I'm saying is, is that the I'm gonna highest take, amount. I'm gonna give you. A, I'm gonna give you a scenario. The highest amount that I've been paid on OnlyFans to do something extraordinary mm-hmm. was, I think. Like eight hundred thousand. Okay. For like seven hundred and fifty dollars. Okay. They wanted me to set my phone up in my bathroom, and they wanted me to dress like a businesswoman. Right. And they wanted me to like basically act out this thing where I'm <laughs> coming in. You see my I like my camera is not there. I'm right. coming in from work, kick my shoes off. Right. Come in the bathroom. Ooh, turn the shower on. It's been a long day. Like basically type shit like that. Right. And they wanted me to strip down, and like right before I like took off, or no, right before I stepped into the shower, mm-hmm. the video they wanted the video to stop. Like so, basically I would have to right. roll and then crop it type shit. Okay, and that's it. It be yeah. Oh it shit! It be shit like that, but it's. I thought she was about to go somewhere crazy. I with know that that's shit. no. I've been paid money like good amounts of money to do just to do that less yeah so only fans is definitely like yeah listen i'm not saying that motherfuckers not with you it can on only money i'm not a hater on only fans i'm a hater on the bitch ass nigga who paid you 800 dollars to do that and didn't ask for no pussy that's <laughs> I mean, I, that's, I, that's that's the way but my don't mind think, is working but I don't, don't make sense but don't think that it's not gonna be freak balls on there. It's not gonna be people. No, yeah, 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 yeah. Some of you niggas is disgusting. Yeah, oh, that's so disgusting. Niggas, that's a, so mentally, you gotta be ready for shit like that. Yeah, yeah. And that I mean, yeah, you gotta do what you gotta do to get your money. But that's what I'm saying. That's any business. Yeah, like, that's for sure. any business. You gotta be willing to. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, like I'm promoting this business, and if your pussy is your business, then yo, porn is. But there's some bitches out here that do OnlyFans and yeah, you can see they pussy, but you can't touch them. You can't touch it. Never. You can't. You won't never. I'm touch just it. saying, they might be y'all. From your city. I'm just saying. Look, the motherfucking porn industry is a multi-billion-dollar industry, bro. It's money being thrown around all over the place. So I, I just, I, my whole thing is, is that if you did that and you got your money off of it, and then later in life you decide you want to live a regular life, a square life, I don't think it's nothing wrong with that. You can't live a regular life after you've been a poor star. I don't know why we got to have this conversation. That's like saying you, you can't a live a regular life after you're a felon, yo. Like, if I hustled and I sold drugs and then I went and did 20 years in the feds, don't I deserve to come home and be able to turn my life around? Ain't it still going to be on your record? It is still. You, okay, yeah, you win. You, you got talking? that one. You got that one. But I can still but still, I, I can still find a way to turn my life around, yeah, right? Yeah, your regular ain't my regular, though. But even as a even as a, as a ex Convict and I and I got a felony. Your regular my, ain't my regular. I mean, I but no, it's billionaires. It's niggas that got hella money out here. Like life as a, a porn star. Yeah. Life as a porn star should be a life, like because everybody <laughs> fucking <laughs> ain't no life. Everybody out here fucking my nigga. Like <laughs> I rather her did it and she said, "Yo, I was getting money," than for her to say I was fucking for free. That well, shit no, is goofy. You, you, like do no, you, hold on. How many porn stars do you think like really getting money? No, I, I mean I'm not saying I'm saying. The ones that's making money, bro. We ain't talking that's about a that. Few. Yeah, we not talking about that. We talking about the ones that's getting money. They be at these motherfucking award shows. They be getting to a bag. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it is what it is. If Only they fans, they be much... getting to a bag. Okay. If, but I, at some they, point, you got age out of everything. I was going to say, if they was getting that much money, they wouldn't be still fucking right up niggas for money. At what point had you fucked enough niggas and got enough money that you not going to fuck niggas for money no more? <laughs> at the point, at the point where you feel like you aged out of that shit, now you want to settle down. You know what that is? What if she owned a truck driving company now? She got a bunch of trucks on the road and shit. Now she done flipped her money into something else. She a regular person. I, mean, now. I see a nigga try to pimp you before I see a nigga cuffing you, wifey you. Or wifey. what if she a hoe? Just what if? Then she would stop. All the whole shit that she done on camera mm-hmm. is really a reflection of who the fuck she is. That is possible. I mean, I just feel like that's possible. But what do that mean? Well, the porn Why would star. You I mean, I can't tell. But that means that she still don't do it for money, stars, though. But I feel like a porn star mentality is somewhat like a whole mentality. And be. I feel like once okay. you got a whole mentality, you always got that whole mentality. I mean, girl, it, uh, shit. No, 
All right, hold on. First of all, because you play on both sides. I like it, but I don't like it. <laughs> you I'm not fucking with y'all back with that. No, I'm saying. I'm not fucking with y'all with that. That was good. I said from the get-go, I really good. don't know how to feel about it. Life at the porn star. Because it's like, what do you do after that? Bitch, you was a porn star. If you flip your money and use it right, you become a business person. You own a business now. You can own a restaurant. You it's can own a whole you business. you was a porn star. This ain't hey, show business. Y'all ain't shit, yo. This a whole and business. Y'all like, judging, what you yo. like? Pinky. Would I marry Pinky? Not now because she don't look the same. But if she was Pinky from the videos and shit, I mean, I I wouldn't know unless I got to know the bitch. And like, and I got around there. <laughs> like, if I started liking Pinky, about getting to know the bitch. if I had started liking Pinky, right? Pinky come around and she be like, "Yo, Envy, like, I want to do your podcast." Yo, this, she come on the podcast. this just goes we to get show to that the bitches, the high end bitches, a lot of the high end single bitches don't stand a chance because niggas is out here cuffing smut. That, no, that's a fact, though. Like, you talking about a porn star. I feel like, I don't know, when do you age out as a porn star? Because I just thought you just go down in the, like, the Hall of Fame. In the porn star Hall just, of Fame. Or you just <laughs> always is a porn star. Or you marry another porn star. I don't you know. Don't I don't know. There you go. You marry star. another yeah. porn star. Yeah. Okay, all right. That's there real. There you go. That's real. Yeah. That, yeah, yeah, baby, you marry yeah. another porn star. Yeah. yeah. So, for me, if I married a porn star, then we would have to start the OnlyFans and me and her get money together. We yeah. had to be a porn star yeah. fan. Because I'm a good friend. If one of my that. friends a star. married no, a married <laughs> porn star, you get what I'm saying? Because I'm a good friend. I would try to fuck her. Not because I want to fuck her, but I would try to fuck her because she a porn star. And I want to make sure that she is going to be loyal to my friend. So you would try. <laughs> Wait, because I think they missed that. Hold on. No, I just said, said what about if friends? one of his homies married a porn star, yeah. he going to try to fuck the bitch. Yeah. Because he want to see if she going to be loyal to his man. Yeah. <laughs> I want no bitch. Make sure he in on it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Make no, sure he in on no, it. No, I... Yo, I don't I like know. that because I feel like that's fucked up because you still judging her like that's fucked up. But I ain't judging. I, but I, I respect I it. I respect her. it. Yeah. I respect what it. What she care about being judged? No, because I'm saying, what if a nigga, if a nigga hustled his whole she life? Don't, what she, I promise you a porn star don't care about being yeah. judged. That's the last thing on their mind. Yeah. But maybe she don't want that brought up every day afterwards. Because if I stop selling no, drugs, bitch. if I stop selling drugs, I don't want every time I come around you, you talking about when I used to sell drugs. You like, bought like your house off selling drugs. Every time you come around, I want to talk about You bought your cars off selling drugs. What are we talking talk about? about we, that's, that's but, then, but, now, but now I'm a podcast. I'm I don't like, want hey, every show. Remember when what? we was getting them bricks that we, we See, bought the no, Range Rovers? No. Remember when we went down Miami? We was on the jet skis. We... Right, but then, sell, but, sell. Then, but then when I go to the corporate building and I need to make these million dollar deals for the podcast, I don't want it to be brought up like, yeah, because you know, you remember you used to sell drugs? Like, no, nah, I don't bring, no, bro, we, we doing something different now. You don't got to always I throw that shit in my face. I promise you, that bitch was a, a queen pen or a drug dealer or something, she would get a whole different type, you feel me, approach, a whole different right. life. 